Hello, I'm Pat O'Hare, Chief Market Analyst for Briefing.com. Today is Monday, December 1st. Virtually every component of GDP will be weaker in the fourth quarter than the third quarter. Real personal consumption expenditures fell a large 0.5% in October. That starts the fourth quarter well below the third quarter average. Even if November and December real PCE are flat, helped by low or down deflators, the average for the fourth quarter will still be down at about a 3% annual rate. This major component will take at least 2% off the fourth quarter real GDP calculation. Net exports have been a strong GDP component for the past few years, adding about 1% annualized per quarter. Not anymore. Exports are slowing due to weak overseas demand and the stronger dollar. Net exports may add a bit in the fourth quarter, but probably will go flat in 2009. The absence of a positive here will be a significant swing factor in the move to a lower GDP trend. Collapsing business investment is also a problem. Non-residential construction turned negative in the third quarter and could start falling sharply in the fourth quarter and beyond. Investment in equipment and software has been down slightly every quarter so far this year, but the recent plunge in orders suggests that a sharper decline in the fourth quarter is likely. Residential construction will continue to decline over the near term. Now, inventories and government spending may offset some of the weakness noted above, but not much. Fourth quarter real GDP is likely to be down at about a 2.5% to 3% annual rate, and the trend suggests a further decline in the first quarter is likely. The longer term outlook may hinge as much on business invest investment trends as on consumer spending trends. The business investment outlook has worsened considerably in recent months with the widespread deep pessimism. I'm Pat O'Hare for Briefing.com. Thanks for listening. <laughs>